Michigan is amazing because you're always stepping from one season into the next. And the property is multi-dimensional where there's water in the front and you have the woods and the little path that takes you to the back. And it's just the sweetest little Michigan adventure that we get to live. One of the design goals was to kind of marry this old with new. So we are still paying homage to the original farmhouse and the property, but also modernizing it a little bit. Aesthetic wise, we were looking for just simplicity to look clean and just an ease of comfort of living. Once we started looking at this property and kind of what had been here, there was this old farmhouse that had sat for, you know, 100 years. We really wanted to honor that kind of just tradition, yet also do a very new thing too. We really wanted to use materials that were simple and clean, but had an inherent authenticity to them that felt like they could be almost indoor and outdoor at the same time. So brick tiles, terrazzo tiles, things that feel grounded. And so Shusugi Ban kind of came about as a way to highlight a natural material, but get that kind of contrasting depth. There's a beauty to having some patina on the outside of your home as well. And so Kurt and Carmel dove in hands on themselves to make that process happen. The original barn was somewhat salvageable and so we were thrilled that we could repair that and keep it as part of the property and now we've turned it into our chicken coop. So the chickens are so cozy out there and it's fun to look out and see them and know that we have a piece of the history of the property there. And in the design process, Liz talks a lot about you're gonna have this moment and to now see it come to life. So like this front entry area has its own moment. These design details like the stair railing and the front door. So as the light shifts throughout the day, you get these beautiful dynamic moments but then fun little custom details that make it feel alive and playful. So one of the really cool things in the design is above the kids' bedrooms is a separate area and it's their own space. There's stairs climbing up the wall. They love that space. It's so nice for homeowners to be able to have a little tucked away area. And so we really were able to embrace that with this indoor-outdoor feel of a screen room attached off of their main bedroom. It's almost like two bedrooms in one. With a hanging bed, we get to open up all the windows in that space it's separate from the bedroom, but it feels like its own little oasis. Like being in a hammock, but a lot more comfortable. And then we loved the idea of taking that really just airy feel of their principal suite right into the bathroom. It's wabi-sabi tile that flows up the wall. It's very perfectly imperfect. We really tried to celebrate the materials that are here. When it came to dressing up things like the cabinetry, the doors, we wanted to continue that theme, which is very simple, beautiful, but well-functioning locks and hardware. Because we have a custom front door and it was important that the door hardware was custom as well and with the level home bolt it disappears into the hardware that we already have so that's an amazing thing that we can keep the same hardware and it becomes smart internally because we talk about wanting a simpler lifestyle but there are some things that you have to set up so that your lifestyle really is simpler so the level touch system it, just works great. A lot of times my hands are just full when I'm coming in. The ability to just touch the lock and it, and it opens quickly for us is so nice. I think my favorite space in the whole house is the outdoor wood burning screened in porch. Just the radiant heat that a wood burning fireplace puts off is irreplaceable. We'll roast marshmallows out there and the kids just have a blast with it and it's part of Michigan life.